Welcome, everybody. Welcome. So this is going to be a, um, this is going to be a reading just for, um, hold on a second. All right. This is going to be a reading just for, um, Haley and Justin. I'm going to see what's going on from right now until the end of the year and what they can expect for the overarching energy for the year of 2023. So I'm going to be pulling just a few cards. This video is going to be short, guys. And keep in mind, this is for entertainment purposes only. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let's see what is going to happen. I don't want to put Selena on this because... I just want, you know, I just think after her documentary, it's just very clear that she just wants that chapter of her life to be done with, which, you know what? God bless her. Amen to her. Seriously. All right. For Haley Spirit and Justin Bieber. Haley and Justin Bieber, please. It's okay. Nine of Cups. Wow. Three of Wands. And then the Two of Wands. Okay, let me put this. All right, now for Justin. He's got the King of Pentacles. That's Haley's father, allegedly. The Two of Cups, oh boy. And the Moon. And then the Four of Pentacles. What they don't see coming is the Four of Swords. And their challenge is the Queen of Pentacles. Oh wow, so we have a pair here, guys. The Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. But the Queen of Pentacles happens to be the challenge. Five of Pentacles, abuse of power. Okay. Um, so Haley has the Hierophant, right? So Right now, she's actually, she's, I feel like she's going to, to her to church a lot. I feel like she's obeying by the marriage, this, you know, the spiritual values, the morals of her, of her, of her marriage with Justin. I do. Um, and with the nine of cups, this is in the known position. I feel like. In this month and in December, she's going to actually be doing thing that's doing things that's really going to make her emotionally fulfilled and feel uh, very supported as well. Um, knowledge, good fortune, unknown. We have the three of wands. And then the outcome is the two of wands. Okay, so in the unknown position, she has the three of wands. And that says, um, it says freedom. And then the two of wands is the outcome. So that's unity, planning ahead, coming together. I feel like 
she's actually there's some sort of this door is opening up for for her um and what she's not aware of is when these doors are actually opened and all these like these opportunities especially when it comes to her marriage when they start opening There's an energy here of her ships are like finally coming in. She's expecting something. I want to know what she's expecting. What is she expecting, Spirit, with the Three of Wands? What is Haley Bieber expecting with the Three of Wands, please? We get the Page of Pentacles, new experiences. Oh, wow. Okay, she's making a lot. Of, okay, she's coming down. She's like, she's got a lot of opportunities right now in front of her. Um, and she's narrowing down to one choice she wants to make. And with this choice, she's kind of like planting a seed because she wants a new experience, especially within her marriage. I'm telling you. And the outcome, it's going to actually, it's going to bring her and, guys, sorry, but it's going to bring her and Justin together. Now, Justin has the King of Pentacles, who he is right now, which is financially stable. It could also be the father, um, allegedly. But, yeah, with the King of Pentacles, it says the mentor. And then... The challenge is the Queen of Pentacles, growth. I feel like someone, especially, maybe it's Haley's father, I don't know guys, but I feel like he's advising Justin to do something in regards to his finances. And the challenge for him is the Queen of Pentacles, which is growth. So with this advice, he's trying to do it, but for whatever reason, he's struggling. Now in the known position, he's got the two of cups. So this is all about union. Again, unity, union. I do feel that for some way, for some way reason, after this whole documentary, whatever, I feel like it's kind of put everything to rest and it's kind of even put some things to rest even for him and Haley and his marriage I feel like he is going to be trying to get closer to her um now in the unknown position we have the moon which is very interesting which is an illusion it's it's secret it's things being hidden for you from you And then the outcome is stability for Pentacles. What is this moon card spirit for Justin Bieber? What is this moon, please? I've got the temperance, one more. We got the Ace of Cups, the Six of Swords, Four of Cups, and then look who came out, the Queen of Wands, guys. That's Haley. All right. So in the unknown position, he has the Ace of Cups, which is all about overpouring of emotions. He's got the Six of Swords, which is moving on, creating boundaries for yourself as well. Queen of Wands, Passion, Four of Cups, Awareness.
what's being hidden? I feel like Haley's hiding something from him. I do, I feel like she's trying, whatever this rejection, whatever this awareness that she's even aware of, she's kind of taking that in her own hands with the Four of Cups, the Queen of Wands, to the Six of Swords, and she's trying to move on and take it and like throw it away in a way, in a sense, and show and trying to show up to him with overpouring of emotions. She's she's be she's doing something behind the scenes. She really is. Um, I want to know though. I want to clarify this. Um, why this is the challenge for justin the queen of pentacles for the, so the mentor he's being advised from Haley's father allegedly guys remember this is for entertainment purposes only but he's being advised by her father when it comes to the finances but he's struggling because the challenge is the queen of pentacles which says growth nine of swords yep not sleeping why? Why is he not sleeping? What is the stress about? Being recognized. For what? And then we get the four of pentacles again, you guys. He's struggling. I feel like he's going to be gaining more attention, doing a lot more work. Like, I don't know if he's got, you know, gigs going on, but with the Six of Wands, it's like somebody seeking attention, you know, being recognized for what they do, being famous or whatever. And then, so that could be him doing things you know to make money but then the four of pentacles is also about it's also about like holding on to your money and then the nine of swords is being stressed out i gotta get one more one more please spirit judgment yep he's embarrassed there's something that he feels be that he's being judged on as he's being advised to take these gigs so whatever this judgment is whatever this judgment is all about seeking forgiveness but also being exposed so he's going to be being feeling exposed. I don't know if about I don't know if it's so called being exposed, but it's more so like feeling exposed. So because of that he's holding on to the money rather than you know doing whatever this mentor, the king of pentacles, pentacles is telling him to do as he's you know persevering fighting through with the six of wands. But he's really feeling embarrassed with the Nine of Swords and he's not able to sleep. So he is going to be struggling, guys, from now to the end of the year. But he is being advised by, I'm definitely picking up, he's being advised by the father to be more smart and um, more wise when it comes to the money. What's the year 2023 going to look like for Haley and Justin? Ace of Discs, a new beginning. Planting a seed, guys. This is a bigger seed, though. This, Whatever Haley planted is planting, it's going to grow between them. What is this going to be about? What is this growth about, Spirit?
And this could also be too, like maybe things weren't working out. Ooh, maybe things weren't working out because the Ace of Pentacles does represent like something that's that wasn't working out. It's uh, and you have to start over. So, Queen of Cups. I don't even want to say that's Selena, but that is. Maybe they're going to be more emotionally in tune together. What about this Queen of Cups? The Hanged One. And then the Nine of Wands. Eight of Swords. They're going to be going through a big time out in the year 2023 when it comes to how they perceive themselves, how they perceive life when it comes to especially being emotionally stable. They're going to be, I think they're going to be focusing more so on becoming emotionally mature and in tune is what I'm getting, guys. I don't know. This is, I'm not trying to make this a negative reading. I'm really not. I'm trying to just see the positive in this. So I did my best. I'm not trying to promote hate. I'm just trying to keep it neutral, you know? All right, guys. Thank you so much. If you like content like this, like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that way you do know when I post more videos. All right, bye.